All right, what's going on? And welcome to KAE Sports Talk. So, so if you can at least, um, yep, give me the HKO special. Hit the like, subscribe, and comment on this video. Ooh. So let's see, what are we gonna talk about? Well, let's see. Um, you know, um, the Stanley Cup just finished about a couple of days ago, and you know the Las Vegas Knights uh, won uh, their first cup, right? So everything is smooth. Of course, now even uh, Joe Biden goes, yeah, the, yeah, Las Vegas, yeah. First, so this is the thing, first team to win it all in Las Vegas. But they're not the first team to do it all. No, but, you know, somebody had to say something about it. Because, you know, Joe Biden is senile. So here we go. Uh-oh. So, Aja Wilson, yep, yep, you know, Aces Aja Wilson tweets frustration with Joe Biden calling Golden Lights the Las Vegas first champions. So, let's see here, Las Vegas Aces star Aja Wilson took offense from a we recent tweet from President Biden who claimed that the Vegas Golden Knights were the first major professional franchise in proud American city. So here's what you need to know. Wilson led the Aces to the WNBA title in September, their first in franchise history. Wilson, a two-time WNBA MVP, added in a tweet that the Aces have not visited the White House since their championships. Oh, so I didn't even know that part. And then a member of the Aces front office confirmed to the athlete that Las Vegas was invited to the White House. And, you know, the last team to go was uh, during the, the uh, Biden administration previously invited the 2020 NBA champions to Seattle Storm to the White House after their title run. But the 2021 champion to Chicago Sky did not make an official visit. So, yeah, so there you go. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but yeah, there you go. Okay, so, wow. So, yep, Joe Biden. Of course, you see now his handlers are probably uh, helping with his Twitter. But on the other hand, who watches the WNBA except a few, you know? Who knew that the Aces won, you know? So, yes, even a, a person, not Joe Biden, could probably still make that mistake, too, saying it could be the first title that Vegas has won. But, okay, yeah, Joe Wilson, you're correct, but... Nobody knows about the Aces, okay? Nobody, you know. I'm probably one of the few that knows it, but I'm one in a few, okay? I am one of the few. Uh, and, of course, you know, I don't watch a lot of WNBA anymore because why? You guys just keep gaslighting us, you know, after all these tweets. You know, when uh, I see, like, you know, uh, she's nice, uh, I'm not nice, you know. It, it's just those little things. And, you know, you as a league that's been subsidized for 26 years, I mean, we're $260 million in debt, you know. And, I mean, you're lucky to even have a job. So, yeah, it's. And it's a case of entitlement, entitlement, entitlement. And, you know, it's like I said, it's a revenue, revenue, revenue problem. It's not a gender issue. It's not, you know, 
and of course the the NBA. You know, most people want to watch the NBA. The feminists, where are they? They're not supporting you. I mean, you barely sell out. I don't think you even have a sellout. You know, even with uh, Brittany Griner. So it is what it is, you know. And there's nothing more to that. But yeah, you had to open your mouth and say, oh, this, this is the kind of thing that pisses all of us off, too, on top of it. You know, you're sitting here going, ah, ah WNBA. No, we're, we're fed up with it. So that's what it is. All right, everyone. So if anyone enjoyed any of this, yo, give me the HKO special. Help the king out. Hit the like, subscribe, and comment. What do you think? All right. So that's that. I will see you in my next video. Take care.